Having presented the basic idea behind plugins, I'm going to show you the use of three particular plugins that I'm going to be developing in my uh, videos. These are the statistics, a table plugin, and an XY plot plugin. So let's start it by, let's get started, say, by going into um, the SMA Studio forum because here in the extensions link, we're going to find information about those plugins. Let's go now to our SMA Studio worksheet. Click on Tools, Plugins, and then here on the local storage, click on it and you get a drop down menu and select online gallery. The online gallery includes all kind of plugins that are currently available in uh, the uh, SMA Studio Forum website for you to utilize. I'm looking specifically for uh, the table one. So you scroll down in alphabetical order and let's find the table one. There's the table region. And so we say install, and then we are going to present the one called XY plot, XY plot region. Say install. We close this down, and the way that the effect of these two plugins are going to show up will be in the insert menu, and it will show this table option or allows you to format nicely a table and also you're going to have insert plot XY plot which would provide an, a nicer XY plot than the native plot provided by SMA Studio. Now regarding the case of the statistical tools, what it does is add functions to the SMA Studio collection of functions. To see functions, for example, let's look at I click somewhere in the worksheet and click on the function button. And let's look at, for example, complex numbers. It includes five functions. Uh, let's look at matrix and vector. We have alg and augment. And what is interesting here is that all the functions that are provided, most of them are um, provided by SMA Studio, start with lowercase. In the complex number, there are a couple of them, im and re, and that's because that's the traditional name they use in mathematics. But most of the list, uh, list of functions currently available when you install first SMA Studio will be in lowercase. And so <clears throat> I'm going to close this down now and I'm going to go to Tools, Plugins, and Find Statistical Tools. Um, sorry, we got to go to Local Storage, Online Gallery, Statistical Tools. There it is. Now I'm going to say install, close, and then if I go here and you know, click somewhere on the page and then click the function button, if you look at the complex number, it hasn't changed. But if you look at matrix and vector, you're going to see that we had all and augment dot lower cases, but now we have a bunch of them to start with uppercase bezels, bezel J, bezel Y, beta, beta regularize, and a whole lot of new functions that start with uppercase, those were added with the statistical tool plugin. We're going to be using these in the future, this is Dirac tool, and so on. And so that's the effect of that particular plugin. Now if you don't want to deal with those plugins right now, you can proceed to remove them as, as we did before. And so, you know, uh, how to use plugins, and these are the three plugins in particular that we're going to be using. If we go back to the SMA Studio Forum, we're going to find under the extension, remember this is the SMA Studio Forum website, under the extension link in the first page, you're going to find the XY plot region information. If you click on it, you get examples of the use of X, uh, the XY plot region. All of these are um, SMA Studio files that you can download to check the, the, those uses and some additional information. If we go back to the extension and go to the second page, we have the table region information in there and it has some examples of how you can format tables to make them look nicer with colors and so on. If you go to the fifth page, Scroll down all the way 
Actually, let's go back. Go back. Scroll down and go to page four, page five. In there, you're going to find statistical top plugin. Open it up. And then you get these headings, sample estimator, probability density functions, and so on. If you want to see the functions included under those headings, click on the button that says show spoiler, and it will give you a listing of all those functions. For probability density functions, for uh, cumulative density functions, for quantiles, random numbers, and some tools. We're going to be discussing this in a more detail. At this point, I just want to show you how to install those plugins that will be presented in future videos. That was the end of this particular video.